Want to make your performance review process more intuitive with a tool that employees will love? Let's take a quick look at how you can use reviews in Teamflect. First, let's click on the Reviews button located on the left side of the page. In this section, you can see the reviews about yourself. If you are a people manager, you can also see the reviews about your team by clicking Reviews about my team. If you want to view all reviews, you can access them by clicking the All Reviews button. This button is only visible to Teamflect admins. To create a new review, simply click the New Review button on the right side of the screen. You can click the New Review for My Team button to create reviews for your team members. If you are a Teamflect administrator you will see a second option called New Review for All Company or Selected Users. Clicking this will take you to the Admin Center. In the Teamflect Admin Center, you can edit ready-to-use review templates or create a new review cycle. Click the New Review for My Team button to create a review. Then, type the review name and select Reviewees. After this, set the period under the review process. Now choose the most suitable review template for the review you will create. If you wish, you can customize the templates by clicking the Customize Templates button on the Admin Center. If there is an extra note you want to add to the review, you can write your note in this section. Finally, select the due dates for the review. Your review is now ready. You can click the Create button to send the review. Now let's take a look at the content of a review. As mentioned before, you can view the reviews regarding your team by clicking this button. In this section, you can see all reviews about your team members. Click on one of the reviews you want to see. On the left side, you can see the people who have participated in the review. Next to it, you can see the status of the review and the due date of the review. Click the See Review button on the right to open the review. When the review is opened, you can find the reviewee's name on the top left and information about the review on the right. Below this section, you can see the question sets in the review. In this field, you can add the goals within the review period to the review question sets. If you choose to include goals in the review, Teamflect automatically adds the reviewee's goals within the specified period into the review. Under this section, you can see the second and third question sets. By customizing these question sets, you can optimize the reviews and make them more suitable for your company. You can decrease or increase the number of question sets and set the question types as freeform, multiple choice and rating. If you want, you can add a signature, development plan, and 360 feedback section to your reviews. Here, you can see the 360 feedback section included in the review. With this section, you can collect feedback about the employee from other colleagues using a specific feedback template designated by your company. When you reach the bottom of the review, you can see the review results section. You can configure how the review results section will be. You can edit the review criteria and change the metrics name. You can also add goal progress as a metric. If you choose to not add any criteria, there will only be the overall comments and private comments sections. At the bottom of the review, there is the development plan section. After the review, aspects of the reviewee that need improvement are identified. In this section, the reviewee can create a development plan on its own or they can do it together with the reviewer. After the reviewee and reviewer answer the questions in the review, the reviewer can click the Submit and Release button and arrange a one-on-one -on -one meeting with the employee to go over the review. After these meetings are completed, the review becomes ready to be finalized. You can finalize the review period by clicking the Submit and Finalize button. On the right side of the review, you can access other activities of the reviewee during the review period. You can see the recognitions and feedback that the reviewee has received. You can also see the tasks assigned to the reviewee during this time period. If you want to keep a physical copy of a completed review, you can print it too. 
Click on the ellipsis icon in the top right corner of the review, and then select print. Your review is now ready for printing. Thank you so much for watching and see you in another video.